Hi. <laughs> I'm Erin. <laughs> I'm Drew. And this is Our, our craft, craft Table. table. And we're laughing hysterically because we have done the intro about 700 times and True is pretty pissed at me right now. So. <laughs> also, if you're wondering, we're wearing summer clothes because we haven't stepped foot outside because it's freezing. But it's nice and warm inside our house. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so anyway, it's not summer. It's cold outside. It is <laughs> almost Valentine's Day. So we have a project for you guys that I think is pretty simple and really inexpensive. Um, so you want to tell them what it is? Cupid bow arrows and I accidentally made a quill. I think it looks <laughs> cool. So we made Cupid's arrows out of Dollar Tree pencils and I just I love this little pattern on here. We got a whole bunch of different patterns. Uh, Koi can you put a picture right here of all the different patterns that we got. We also got craft feathers from Walmart. So this whole pack right here was $1.88 at our store. So they were, what does it say? It's, it just says white feathers on here. So, um, so that was it. But yeah, this is the one Cupid, Cupid's arrow pencil. How'd you make yours? So basically I put my two feathers, I put two feathers, there's about six feathers I believe on here, um, and so I put two feathers on and then I looped it around, I have embroidery floss <laughs> in my hand, <laughs> and, um, and I looped that around and then, so it was its own little loop, and I put two more on top of the embroidery floss and I looped it again mm -hmm. and I just continued that. It's pretty simple. So I like that. So we can see the difference. This looks so much fuller. That looks really cool. I, I don't to, know. I tried to make it as even as I could because there were some spaces that I didn't like. And I was like, mm. I think that's a good idea though. I like the way yours looks. Yeah. So you can do it either way. So let's go ahead and make one. I'm so tired. So here's another design of pencil. I think this is super cute. And I'm just going to take a couple of feathers, but the feathers that we have, the little pieces go all the way down to the bottom so I'm just kind of and this was True's idea actually she's very smart with this kind of stuff I, I we're moving that down here oh, it was all tangled I fixed it <laughs> thank you Woo. so I removed the little pieces of the feathers from the bottom let me get another one I'm gonna take a couple out so we don't have to keep digging into the bag okay thank you I like this one you might have to search for Feathers that look good. This one actually is already kind of bare at the bottom, so I'll use that. What? It says it's gonna take out a few takes out all. Of <laughs> oh boy. So I, just I like have feathers. One too. Feathers are fun. Feathers are fun. And Wait, where's the other pencil? <laughs> I can't find the other pencil. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put a little dot of glue right on there. Oh, you put glue on? Uh huh. Just to secure it first. And I'm just gonna kinda stick it on there. I think my glue looks overheating. Just sticking the feathers on there. Whichever way. I'm trying to figure out a good way to do it. I think that looks pretty good. And there's feathers on oh. my glue gun. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, this is coming off a little bit, so let me put a little bit more glue. But this is why you have to secure it with glue and embroidery floss because it's not going to stay by itself. So I'm just putting it there and kind of letting it dry a little bit. And there's an embroidery. Oops. Oh, uh -oh. Yeah. there we go. I got it. <laughs> so. I'm going to put, where's the beginning of it? Probably oh. somewhere. Okay, I found it. Oh, crap. Okay. I think so, that the, I think that my hot glue's been overheated because it's kind of brown. Uh oh, that's not good. Um, okay, so I just took the embroidery floss and started wrapping it around. So that now it's securing the feathers on there. And I'm just going to wrap it around a little bit more. Actually, you can 
And twirl it around too, that works. And then that way, you can get a nice bond on there and get everything nice and secure. Wait, can I use your glue gun? Absolutely. Is it going to reach over there? On the feather? I think it might be turning the feather brown, not the glue. Oop, oop, drip. So now I'm kind of putting some of the um, embroidery floss down on the bottom too, just to kind of cover up the feather that's right there. And now, and that's done, I'm going to put a little dab of hot glue on the back to secure the embroidery floss. Put a little dab right there and hopefully you can see that. I'm just kind of going to let that sit there for a minute. And that's it. It's all done. This needs to be pushed down a little bit. There we go. Okay, like a little bit more. I know, I am a perfectionist. I want it pushed down exactly. There we go. So I like that. And for the um, for the little holder part, look, you're doing a really good job. Let's, let's show what you're doing. I'm twisting it around. So the same process. Yeah. I really like that with a lot of flower, uh, flowers, a lot <laughs> of feathers, so that I looks like good too. too. This would be cool with flowers. That would be cool with Ooh, flowers. Oh, I have an idea for our next craft. I got a whole bunch of flowers from Dollar Tree. Did you see those yet? Like actual flowers? Uh, or big fake flowers. flowers. Like yeah, so I didn't know what I was getting them for, so it sounds like she has an idea. Actually, it's going to be different, though. All right. So she's doing that. But um, to have the, the little point again, <laughs> the little point at the bottom, I just cut out two pieces of felt in the shape of hearts, and um, I got, I got glue on. You got it? I got glue on the Oh, that's okay. And then I put hot glue on the bottom part, so let me see if I can kind of demonstrate that. Now yeah, these two feathers just stuck together. <laughs> There's just like hot glue strands everywhere. <laughs> and that's what happens when you mess with hot glue. That's like the worst part of hot glue. I know. Just like the strands are just literally everywhere. No. Remember that thing I made the little um hut thing that I made the little house. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that had that hot glue strands hot glue. everywhere. So this might dry before I can actually put it together. But you see how I just put the hot glue on the bottom part, and so I'm sticking these together. And ooh, I made it. I actually got it stuck together before the hot glue dried completely. But that leaves like a little pouch right here for you to put your your pencil. So this is the one I just did. Where's my pencil? Stick the pencil, pencil in there. And look, my other pencil literally blended it's covered into it. <laughs> like <laughs> it, like I was just like you saying flowers. Oh I didn't know. Covered notice. in feathers. Mom, where's my pencil? I have to look all the way under here. There's all types of... I hit it. This is a mess. Feathers. Literally. Everywhere. Everywhere. But we did a pretty cool project, right? Yes, yes. So, <laughs> I like my this. My pencil keeps disappearing. Let's look at your pencils. Yeah, my pencils. I think they look really good. They're both they very similar. Yeah. I really like yours. Thank you. I like yours too. I might make some more with more, um, with more feathers like that. Because I'm not going to be using the erasers, let's get real. I'm not really going to use these How pencils, they're just for cuteness. That is the project, Ooh. so I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's pretty simple, it's just something cute to do for your desk or, you know, to take to school or, you know, give to kids as um, a Valentine's Day present or something. So, uh, hopefully it's something that you enjoyed and maybe you'll try your hand at it too. So thank you so much for watching us. You did a really good job, True. And 
We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.